This may be you guys' style. So you guys can rock this joint and rock the hell out of these because this is a gimmick and I don't think this is gonna be around for a while. This is gonna have the same effect that Crocs are going through right now where they have to sell everything half off pretty much. Yo, what up y'all? Hey, it's your boy Mo Kicks. And if this is your first time stopping by, make sure you guys like, share, and subscribe. We try to do this every now and again. And if you're returning, make sure you do the same. All right, let's get straight into it. All right, y'all, look, this is part two of my Yeezy Day pickup. All right, look, I don't know what to say about these joints in hand. I've seen pictures, I've seen people out and about wearing these joints, but seeing them in hand, I really don't know how to feel about these joints. All right, we have the Yeezy Foam Runner, all right? And of course, you have this dumb tag that they keep putting on these joints. I mean, it is what it is. They don't really care about trees, I guess. <laughs> At first glance, it looks like it just has a, um, you know, like a, a blackish, grayish type of gunmetal type of feel. When you look deeply, right, you'll be able to see that it has a design on there. But this one has like a gray and a dark gray. Yeah, so I, I thought that was pretty dope that they put that little design on there, even though it's black and you probably wouldn't see it in the dark, but in the light you would. Look, you got your standard interior in here. Resemblance of a croc. Looks like a croc, reminds me of a croc. Um, same material in a way, maybe. I don't know exactly what the materials are made out of, or these crocs are made out of, but they've seen their fair share of wear and tear so i have zero zero doubt that the foam runner will perform and not really break apart because the croc in itself i played basketball in these joints i ran around the track a few times in these joints i did a lot of things i shouldn't have been doing in these joints so durability i'm pretty confident in the looks i'm just not too fond of it reminds me of the matrix machine joints when they're floating through the joint it reminds me of a jet ski it reminds me of a number of things the cool thing about it is the bottom how it resembles a an actual shoe um, since it doesn't have any moving parts you know, it's, it's a cool shoe you know cool mode uh, don't know how comfortable it will be i haven't tried them on probably won't be trying them on so maybe you guys who already have a pair can let me know how comfortable they are in comparison to a croc maybe, or possibly a shoe, just a regular shoe. Let me know how comfortable they are in, compared to a, in comparison to a shoe. Um, it still has the 700 in a way, shape at the bottom for sure, in all these little pockets. But the foam, it's, it's pretty soft. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, look, this ain't my style. This ain't my style at all. This may be you guys' style, so you guys can rock this joint and rock the hell out of these because this is a gimmick and I don't think this is gonna be around for a while. But this is gonna have the same effect that Crocs are going through right now where they have to sell everything half off pretty much. Unless, you know, you keep revamping them and giving them fresh styles and not go backwards and get kind of crazy with it and put mickey mouse and all kind of craziness on there if you don't do that then you might be okay but other than that this seems like a fad but i've seen folks with little feet especially women they kind of look fresh in them um, just folks with big feet like me it's just gonna look clumpy and dumpy get in the comments let me know if you guys have a pair of these and you have big feet and let me know what you guys use your yeezy foam runners for if you go to the store in these joints you play basketball in them do you work out in them let me know, because the only use I can see for these is to go to the beach or to uh, the pool, right? Definitely not nothing swaggy with this. It doesn't. I don't feel swaggy when I look at this. I didn't feel swaggy when I had these. They were just comfortable. I would hoop, take my shoes off and put these joints on. They're easily accessible. You can slip them on, and if you need some extra support, you had a little arch, um, Achilles little uh, joint right here to help keep it in place. I really thought that was cool for the time and everybody else thought they were ugly. So I just kind of think it's ironic that everybody think these are fly and think these are hard because when I'm looking at them, <laughs> they wild. <laughs> but hey, to each his own, I'll let you guys know when I'm ready to let these go. Um, if you're a Kick Squad member, I'll go ahead and give you Kick Squad love. 
but if you're not a kick squad member i'm taxing all right y'all hey look if this is your first time stopping by make sure you guys like share and subscribe we try to do this every now and again you know hey and if you're returning make sure you do the same hey it really helps out the channel you guys and shout out to all the new subscribers all right look my name is mel kicks and on this channel we love our kicks we take care of our kicks and we sometimes wear them things or we get them off when we need to. All right, y'all, I'm out of here. Peace. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Box talk. Box talk, box talk, box talk. It ain't really much to say about this box. Literally folded inside out and all that, right? And it's all cool and all that, but...